All right, what else you got with the news? Uh, let's see here. I'm just going to read this out of today's paper. This is uh, in DeVore, California. The headline is, Five Heroes Killed in California Wildfire Are Honored. The five firefighters killed in the deadliest wildfire disaster in more than a decade were remembered yesterday as both heroes and regular guys at a memorial service attended by more than 10,000 people. Wow. The five were part of the U.S. Forest Service crew of Engine 57. Uh, let me ask you this. Are they heroes? Um, or were they just doing their job? They were doing their job. I'm sorry, it's a terrible thing. These the gentlemen died. Firefighters? Yeah. They're well, heroes. They didn't save They didn't even forest. save a freaking home. They're every, putting themselves every, in harm's way. They're burning up for other people. Maybe in the every city. I feel sorry for them and their family. Yeah, I, course, do but I do too. I do too. That's but a heroic job to have in and of It's a heroic job, yes. But 34 homes. Anywhere the fire decided to go, it was on its own. It yeah. went. It, it took. Yeah. They didn't. It's not like they won one battle. No, they put it's a welcome a mat battle. in front of the fire. Come on, yeah. Come on in. Come on in, dude. They're putting forth gotta go. effort. They're I think trying. they caused more of the problem by not knowing what they were oh, doing. Yeah, insane. right. Right. And them sucking up air. Let me ask you this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Them sucking the air. The fire needs. You know. I mean, they're 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 on the clock. It's not like you know. I think you if you jumped up out of your seat. Yeah. And you ran out there to the woods and you said, hey, and you got a cape on. <laughs> First of all, the hero wears a cape. Um, yeah, you know what? And hero, you've got, you, you know, that. jugs of water and you've got a plan right. and you and you actually make a difference. You save one of the homes. Uh -huh. You're a hero. Yes. But they're they're only calling these guys heroes because they died. Yeah. Let's say they just went out there and put out the fire like they were supposed to. Yeah. They would have just said, all right, good day's work. Hey, excellent. And you, why you does no paycheck. other job get that title of hero? You're right. You take this for example. Uh -huh. oh, you got a guy who's working at Burger King. Oh, yeah. Sometimes the line gets backed up. Oh, terrible. Of, of orders, right? Oh, yeah. I, I, when I worked at McDonald's, I always had to be the run-out guy. Right. So uh, <laughs> just park over in, in uh, number two and we'll get to you. Oh, and and the people that. are out there. They're fuming. I hate that. It's fast food. So when Why? you finally get the bag, you got to run. So yeah. let's say oh. this guy runs and he's, he's taken off and he has to actually cross oh. the cars that are peeling out of the drive-thru. Right. Boom. Oh. He gets leveled, but as... He gets leveled and he's yeah. dying. He throws the bag to the customer. In the window, lands in his lap, not a and the and that guy a leaves. Out of place. Right. The Camaro just rolls right over the guy. Right. But I bet you he ain't a hero while he was on the clock. He should be right there. You saved a man's oh, lunch. Oh man, what a is is that? Would that kid be considered a hero? No. He was just doing his job, right? He doing his job. A Mick hero. Oh, and I'm sorry God. they died. Vinny in New York. Hello, Vinny. They're heroes. Yeah, listen, they're not heroes. They're oh. just doing their job. It's yeah. a tragedy. It's always it's a tragedy when somebody dies working. Yeah. But they use that word hero for everything now. Right. Yeah. Everybody's no, a hero. Yeah, they, I think they I are. I need a hero. Uh, to be a hero. firefighter. I think they're throwing it out a little too much. It's most selfless job. You're not getting it is. paid squat. Well, we all You're agree with that. Yeah, that's terrible. Fighting fires for no other reason than help Horror other service. people. I think, I think we all ag uh, agree with that. I think we're all in, in agreement yeah. that it's uh, agreeance. huh? Agreeance, right? Is that not a real word? Agreement. <laughs> an agreement. Then I'm going to go with whatever one is the right one. Yeah. Agreeable. There you go. No, I we think can't. we're all in agreeable that. Uh, <laughs> Thanks, Shut it. Agreement. Agree. No, no, no. That's a whole different thing. Okay. <laughs> You're in agreement. We're all in agreement here. Meat. A meat minced. A meat minced. A meat minced pie. I think we agree with you on that one, Lou, that, of course, it is oh a commendable God. job. And, yeah, and we, we've we said that over. Something we would never do because we're no pussies. Yeah, yeah. We, we've said that over and over and over. you got to have a lot of respect for anyone that signs up for a job where they put their life on the line. Right. But what I'm saying is unless you can directly connect, let's say that guy w ran into the building, mm -hmm. saved the child and the dog. And put the child, you know, in in whatever the pool, or, or somewhere in a basket, sure. and and the dog back in his kennel. Yeah. But then he was burned in the process. That man is a hero. To Come me on. too. How yeah. many other people do you know that he might have saved tens of, you know, dozens of other people in in the past? Well, then that's when you give him the hero badge. And you're just saying that because okay. this attempt was in your mind unsuccessful, that he's <clears throat> not a hero because of it? Um, um, um. Here we go. There we go. Joe, Rockland County. What's up, Joe? Yo. Hey. What's going hey, on? Hey, what's going on? Yo, let me tell you guys something. First of all, I'm a member of service. I'm in the fire department. volunteer for five years. Yep, me too. Oh, okay. you liar. Now, you, you guys have drug tests, bro. <laughs> huh? We have one mission, to protect lives and property. Okay. Right. Okay? You guys are saying this guy's a hero because he's doing his job and dying. Hey, no oh, cussing. No cursing, please. No cussing. No swearing. Sorry. Sorry about that, but right. you, you guys 
call about is really pissing me off. I'm really, I'm really. Me too. Really, 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 I'm with you. No, 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 no. <laughs> We just think they throw the word hero around a little too yeah, much. Yeah, a little bit too much. Not for firefighters. That's all, Joe. You throw it you're around probably right with the firefighters. firefighters. Yeah, you're right. Nah, well, still. I'm, I'm can't, no, all firefighters to it on this are one. heroes. Okay. You, 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 they do a job. You do a heroic job. Yeah. You do. That makes you a hero. But, but we have to go event by event. I'll be honest. There are some days that I walk out of this studio mm. and I feel like a hero. And you get a hero's be- welcome walking Because out. the hero... Yes. In me came out, right, and I, I right. did a show that was yes. beyond just the average, you know, punch in. Yeah, do your thing. Yeah, punching in on the clock, jack, right. spinning a record, Wolfman right. Jack. Hey, hey, what's going on? This is song hey, number Wolfman. seven, and it's yeah. probably climbing up the charts it's here, and this goes out buddy. to Long Island Doghouse. Oh, screaming why do up, I have a feeling you're going to be giving $5,000 of your money? That no, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. You know why? Because the firefighters understand. <laughs> they all understand. Yeah. you got to give props where the props are due. Right. When, like I said before, heroic job. We've always respected the man in the uniform. I'm not giving five thousand dollars to crap. Right. Yeah. Matter of fact, we've already been invited to several barbecues. Right. Didn't have time to make it. But right. No, because we, you know, value our lives. The firemen out there, except for that one caller, love us. Yeah. So come on now. But I think, and I think they would agree. Only put on my grave that I was a hero if I died in the act. You, oh. you. Now you can say that. This guy had on his record many heroic events, yes. or, or many. There were many times that that he was a hero. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's the same as my job, right? Yeah. Oh, you're insane. It's, I, I would parade. say nine yeah. times out of ten, right. I'm you know a hero. Uh, well, not not a hero. See, that's is, the thing that sucks about my job is I'm never really. You're never really. Yeah, but in your mind, you know you are. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You're right. You're right. I mean, and people have to back you up with telling you a few times a week, hey, I'm down with that. Yeah. What is hero? What, when you look it up in the dictionary, what is it? Well, say? we've talked about this before. Okay. I, I, I think a hero is... I need a hero. I think it's someone that goes into something knowing that they're going, or that there's a good chance it's likely that they're going to die. That's what we came... Okay. We all came to that same... Right. And, and and here's here's what happened with, with these guys. Mm. I know, because I've got the inside track. All right. I'm always... While you're laying around on the couch all weekend, yeah. sir, watching football, mm, making chili, as a as a um, what do you, what do you call it? He said, "Is a reserve fireman." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, don't 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 talk like you're one of the regular guys. Yeah, you're first volunteer. of all, he could be on call. He's on call to do something that could potentially get him killed at any moment. That's true, but right. that's now. That's let's besides just, the point. Quick, come up with yeah. good comebacks. My yeah, hero over here is trying to make a point. No, so, he does. So what we were, we had this uh, discussion before about what a hero was, and I think we all agreed that it's someone that goes into a situation knowing I probably will or or, or could die by doing at this moment what I'm about to do. These guys, from what I understand anyway, were like standing there on a cigarette break, mm. and then just all of a sudden. <laughs> something came up from behind that right. they weren't even paying attention to. Right, right. right. Took them out, took their asses out. Right. And so on that, you can't really go hero unless you're. Mm. I, I would just put on it, you know. Goddamn, guys. Yes. Yeah. What? Shoot. Not sure. You're insane. <laughs> yeah. You're insane. Yeah. Right. So. Gotta take a break. break when I time. Come back. Let me open up the checkbook. Ninety-two <laughs> three free FM. It's the dog out. Dog out on a Monday. It's JV and Ellis. Go to the phone, huh? Brian in Connecticut. Que paso, amigo? Yo, what's going on? What's up, brother? Dog out! What? Come on! (laughs) That was good. Listen, these firefighters, man. I mean, you got... They might tell the volunteer firefighters are suing because they're giving the calls to the real firefighters. I mean, come on. Really? And really? Not, here's this. Why am I not a hero for employing eight people and giving them their payroll every day where they can go out and spend their money? Did you sexually harass them? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, come on. What's this hero thing? Well, here's oh, the thing. Sometimes you are a hero. Yeah. You take, for, uh, for example, uh, a cop. Oh, yeah, big time. Heroic it is job. a heroic job. Yeah. First day. of all, let's establish heroic jobs. You yeah. know, cops, firefighters. Paramedics? Paramedics. Yeah, totally. These are all heroic jobs. You're right. Heroic but let's job. say a, par- a paramedic goes out and uh, he, you know, gives uh, someone a, a glass of water because mm. it was a hot day. Yeah. Just don't call him a hero on that one. Here's if they part. save someone's life, 
when the fire department shows up on scene first, and they're mm -hmm. always there first, but before the cops even arrive, yeah. and they pull someone out of this car, you know, with the jaws of life, and they resuscitate them, and they bring them back to life. Oh, yeah. Damn straight. That hero. was, you are a hero. You brought someone back to life. Sure. But. I'm sure even firemen don't consider it every day. They're going to be, I'm going to be honest, all I did today was pose for a calendar, huh. have a cup of coffee, yeah. slid down the pole, and wash oh, the, uh, the spotted dog. At any moment, these people can die for running into a building trying to save other people. And you're just equating, you know, them playing with a Dalmatian as the only thing that they do, and they're not hurting. Hey, don't, don't Why pull do they have that a Dalmatian? crap with me. What's the deal with the You have to. It's just it's illegal. Why can't they get other they dogs? That's racist. It's in the Constitution. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not something that, that's going to be changed anytime need to get soon. A different dog is what they need. <laughs> Let's go to uh, John in Rockland. How you doing, Johnny? Subway. Eat, Eat fresh. fresh. Subway. Up, guys? Eat I, fresh. I, I calmed down a little bit when you guys right. first said there was an heroic job men out heroes, man. No, no, I no. got heated. See, I'm see, I'm a police officer and a volunteer firefighter. Good for you, man. That's amazing. World, Good deal. No, I bust my I bust my bulls every day, trying to make sure everybody in my community is well protected. You keep right. the kinks now, out not, of your hose. What's up? Keep those kinks out of your hose. Oh, pretty much, man. Mm -hmm. Tell me about mm -hmm. it. I'd love my to. Wife, that's my wife's job. <laughs> Speaking of hose, yeah. oh, what? Hey, no. Hey! Oh, oh, just kidding. Just kidding. No. Hey, Jesus. hey, listen. As far the firemen, no, don't go away pissed off. Just go away. Oh, no, no. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, no, no. I think the firemen that have been here with us day one have heard us say over and over and over. Yeah. And then the military men as well. Certainly. They, they have heard us, despite our political views, this, despite any story. Because all this was, with, with these particular firefighters in California. Forest rangers. It was a grass fire, man. Yeah. This is the easiest thing to handle. You can go out and flip flops. You don't even have you to put right. on the equipment. You, no. you go out and flip flops. It is the easiest thing to handle right. next to an oil derrick that is fully ablaze, like out in Kuwait. <laughs> Those things are still on fire four years later. Are you kidding me? I don't know. Those are brutal. Something like that. They are totally different things. Yeah. A little patch of grass compared to a little white. I, I bet you the average firefighter would call in and police officer and uh, call up and agree and get what we're saying. Mm. That they're that agree they. With you. I'll bet you. I'll Come bet on. you we. Uh, we'll take a couple calls from firefighters. Because the circumstances surrounding this guy's death were not heroic in and of themselves, because he wasn't saving somebody. That he's not a hero. Come on. The guy no. gave his life for the, a cause that the, is totally heroic. The guy a had a, a heroic job. Yeah. Yeah. That's the other thing is. A hero means you're just doing it. You'll go into a for doing it. So if if his wife yes. doesn't get that check, right? Then I'm not. Then a you're hero. more of a hero. Yes. <laughs> if you unattach that paycheck, right. then then I'll I'll right. actually I'll give him status so hero. Some props. To make their twenty five grand a year, or whatever they make. Oh shut up! Quit, Come on. Quit being Captain Save a, a fireman. Yeah. Let me tell you something. I think the average fireman would uh, agree with this. Same with the police officer, that, that you have a very heroic uh, job. And, and a job, job that, you know, it, it's a man's man's job. You're right. And you have nothing but respect. But, but you can get what we're saying. If, you know, if you slip on a banana peel on the way into a... On, in, into a building, we just can't give you the badge on that. Right, right, right. Yeah. They know what we're saying. Certainly. Right? I think they know. I slipped on a banana peel. Totally. <laughs> There's a goddamn banana peel sound effect when you need one. Yeah, we need to make one. No, not you. <laughs> Listeners are way better at stuff than I'll you are. I'll go home and make one. Any more calls before we move on with the news? Yeah, let's go to uh, Sal the Jew. What's up, Sal? Hey, what's going on, doghouse? What? Oh, this guy's oh. not happy. What's wrong? Dude, um, my, my life is basically over, man. Uh, uh, I hear you. Yeah, in September, I, I'm a bodyguard, okay? So mm -hmm. September, in September, they put me... Uh, well, I thought I was a hero anyway, so mm -hmm. in, September, in September they put me in uh, this uh, all-girls high school, okay? Yeah. And uh, everything, you know, was going according to plan. Everything was beautiful. Security, everything was done there. Right. You know, everything was great, okay? All yeah. of a sudden, you know, this one girl, she's 16 years old, She, but she looks like she's 22. She, you know, she, she comes to the hallway, starts talking to me one day, whatever, whatever. I end up, uh, you know, she, she's telling me that she wants to leave. she wants to leave this place and go to public school. So I said, you know what, honey, this is not that's not the place for you. Stay over here. It was my commitment to keep this girl in the school, okay? That's what I was trying to do. Right. And All to I keep did. you in this girl, yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then and then uh so anyway, so this girl basically she slipped me her number one day. I didn't use it. She got my number. Oh. 
she calls me, okay, I try to just help her out to tell her, listen, we can't really talk on the phone, but, you know, you just stay in this school, we'll talk in school. You know, I, I told the principal about it, I told everybody about it. Anyways, comes out, this girl tells her mom, I tried calling her. Mm. Now I am gone, bro. My, that's it, they fired mm. me last night. So you said bodyguard or are you security guard? No, 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 no. I'm about we, my company I work for. It's an Israeli company. Okay. We do bodyguard work for uh, diplomats, politicians, mm. all those sort of things. Airport security. Mm. So now you're blacklisted from doing it, right? I'm, I'm not blacklisted. Like the, the, my company is going to keep me with okay. the job. They 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 want to just take me to another school because they know how I work, man. But this oh, yeah. is. You know what I mean? There's something like this ruins somebody's name. You know, I mean, yeah. and I'm over, I'm sitting over here with my gun, and I don't know what I'm thinking. Whoa, your gun? Well, unload it. Yeah, yeah no, don't, don't do not. Yeah, it's it, you'll, you'll find something, bro. I know I'm gonna find something, man. But this is my life. Yeah, we understand. It's not over. It's just a bad day. Yeah. I mean, you didn't get fired. There's a circumstance that's going on. You'll get through it. Rudy, get the guy a crank water. You want, <laughs> crank water. First of all, yeah, before we decide where we're going with this. Mm -hmm. Sal? Yeah, I'm here. Okay. So you said, now, she, it's an all teenage school, but she looked 22. Yeah. Okay, that, first of all, that's her fault. Yeah, that's not, not on you, bro. Yeah. Yeah. They're growing different yeah. now. They're growing different. Yeah. That's, now, definitely try to use that in your defense. Because, yeah, right. Um, let's see. Are you going to be going to any kind of court or anything on this? I don't. I, I don't believe so. I think they're gonna just keep it very quiet, and then I'm just gonna move to the next school. Because if you go yeah. to court, then I'd kill yourself. Yeah. 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 All right. No, no, I'm not going I'm to kidding. court. Dude. Okay. No, you'll be all right. You'll be okay. Well, good luck to you, man. I'm sorry that happened. Yeah. Listen, you guys are gonna hear me one day on the radio on the West Coast. I'm moving out there. Are you? Yeah. That's, that's what I'm trying to do. I love radio. I've been listening to that since since I started working at those type of schools last last uh, last January, something like that. I mm -hmm. love you guys. There's love nothing you too, like. Sal. Jersey Doghouse, baby, come on. All right. Come on. Thanks a lot, buddy. I think you, you, you probably uh, mix in better there anyway. Mm -hmm. A lot more pedophiles. <laughs> a lot more. Yeah. Jeez. You can move around a little easier. Just kidding, yeah. yeah. Wow, that really sucks. Man. Brutal. Yeah, you can't slip someone the number. No, not good. Well, he's trying to be helpful. No, no, it doesn't matter. You yeah, I know, think. but you got to think before you do that. Well, he he did it. It's not like he kept it away from the principal. He told the superiors that this girl After was, the fact. was just trying to be friendly and nice. It had nothing to do with about personality. You're backing up a Jew? Hell yeah. Oh, wow. That's amazing. Well, we've come, you know, full circle. A little way. Yeah. i got to take every chance I can right. get. I know I got thrown out of school. I was just trying to slip a few fingers. <laughs> Principal. Uh, let's go to Stephen. He's saying we're. Stephen! says on the screen. Well, we'll let him say what he's saying. Stephen, how are you, sir? Dog house! What? Let me get a crank water. Get him a crank water, Punch God dang it! man up! Coming right up. Lots of ice cubes in that one. Oh, that's tasty. Mm. What's going on, Stephen? What's going on, guys? Nothing. Listen, I'm the United States Marine. Okay. Surfing well. Iraq and everything. What you guys said. I mean, you're kind of discrediting all the, everybody else. You that's know, the not police true. police officers, no. firemen. No, we're you know, I mean, you know, we put ourselves out of the front line every day. And we yeah. say that, Stephen. you got to understand, we still got a show to do. we still right. got to have some fun and throw out some comedy. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, no, no. I yeah. have all the love, love of my heart for you guys. Okay. You guys are all great. right. All right. Well, see there. Love see what I'm saying? Read. This guy knows. that We give nothing but respect to all the men in a uniform, Sir. but we still got a show to do. Right, exactly. And like I said, these, these guys that were out there, uh, you know, with this particular fire. Yes. Mm -hmm. I, I know. This should have just been a, a simple thing. Right. It, it, it only had about like five, what was it, clean? five and eight thousand acres yeah. that these three guys had to put out. I know. Get I, on it. Get yeah. back to the house. Get Let's the hose go. Unroll. Let's, you know. Come on. Just get out there. Do your thing. Stomp it out. Uh, we got to take a break. Come on, player. <laughs> stomp it out, player. <laughs> that was the problem. Oh. They tried to stomp the whole thing out. Oh. You cannot stomp out five thousand acres. You're adding fuel. At to the some planes. point, you know. At some point, set your ego aside. Mm. And go with the training that you've been. You ain't doing. all that in the flip flops. Come on, ho ho ho.